So guys, we have to get some brand new information on some new MM2 toys coming very soon, including some MM2 toy codes for Roblox. Now for those who don't know, MM2 has released a good amount of toys in its day, and last year we did see the three MM2 Jazzwares toys, all with their own Roblox toy codes. But it seems that it's finally time for us to get some new MM2 toys later this year. As usual, these toys are found by Lily Gia because Lily Gia is just always the first person to find Roblox toy news. She's like the goddess at that. And as you can see right here, here is the brand new MM2 Dev Series toys. What's interesting about this set of toys is not actually just for all of MM2, but it's based around the research facility map, which I actually thought was pretty cool, not gonna lie. It's like the first set of MM2 toys that actually has its own theme around it, based off of this map that we're looking at right now. As you can see, there's a Nicholas inside of a test tube, as well as a scientist and like a robot spider head guy, as well as some accessories like a knife, gun, and whatever those two things are. Something I found interesting is that these toys made Nicholas's shades green when uh, Nicholas doesn't have green shades, they're usually blue, but okay. It's not a big deal, I just noticed that. But as usual, these toys are going to be coming out with a brand new Roblox toy code as well. And here is what the toy is gonna look like right here, the chemical tank helmet. At least this is what we assume the research facility toy code is going to be. It's very interesting, you wouldn't expect this from an MM2 toy, but of course, since it is based off research facility, it does make sense. This is how it looked like on my character. Um, It doesn't fit the marshmallow hat, so let me just put my hat off real quick. And yeah, there, there is what I look like right there with the chemical tank helmet. Uh, it's definitely very interesting. I don't know if I'll be wearing this personally, but hey, for those who always want to be inside of a research facility test tube, uh, there you go, I guess. But something I am speculating on is that we might be getting even more MM2 dev series toys coming later this year, not just this research facility set. Because later last year, we did get some more MM2 toy code leaks, specifically two extra ones, one being this knife or that ended up getting leaked, which is obviously gonna be for Murder Mystery 2. Like, there's not even any question about it. As well as these skin the eyes, which people are assuming is also going to be for Murder Mystery 2, because it kind of matches the running Victor toy from the last MM2 toy set. This chemical tank helmet was leaked with those toys sometime last year, but no one really expected this to be for Murder Mystery 2 until we got the research facility toy set. Then we figured out, like, yeah, this is probably for Murder Mystery 2. So yeah, expect us to see even more MM2 toys coming out very soon. I believe this MM2 toy set has been leaked to us, so there's a good chance we'll be getting some more leaks very soon, so I might end up making a follow-up video talking about more MM2 Two toys coming very soon. And when these toys eventually are released, I'll be making my own separate video redeeming all these toys when they are released. Because as you guys do know, I do love my Murder Mystery 2 toys. As you guys can see, I just turned on camera mode right now. And as you can see, like I literally have this Nicholas Gusham guy. It's, it's kind of bright, but as you guys can see, he's usually just on my desk. Like, can I can I do this? Wait, hold on. Look at this. My boy is just on the desk right there. I even have this elite knife box right here, which is really cool. So yeah, I'm personally very excited for these MM2 toys. So I do like to collect all the toys that MM2 does end up releasing so please let me know in the comments if you guys are going to be getting these mm2 toys for yourself i think it'd be pretty cool to have nicholas in a test tube just chilling somewhere i mean i don't know about you guys but i am personally pretty excited about that and i am pretty excited for the rest of the mm2 toys that we are probably going to be getting very soon and if you guys are wondering i wouldn't count on these toys actually being redeemable in murder mystery 2 as much as i'd like them to be the last mm2 toys we got we did not get any redeemable item in murder mystery 2 so i think there's a good chance that we're not going to be getting anything for MM2 as well, unfortunately. Unless Nicholas does want to do something pretty cool and give us something in-game, but as of right now, I wouldn't count on it. Yeah, guys, that's about it for this video, so I'm gonna end it off here. Until next time, goodbye!